Hi everyone, welcome to my kitchen. Uh, my name is Ed Kings, and you can also refer to me as Martin if you would like. But yeah, today uh, is going to be our first cooking stream from my kitchen. So for today, I will be making a garlic bread, a pasta. That's the side dish. We're going to be making a pasta with a creamy bell pepper sauce, followed by a chicken parm. At some point it's going to cover my face, but it's okay. Oh, actually, no. This is a perfect spot for my face. The other thing that I don't have a picture for, but uh, you can imagine it, um, since one of our guests is vegetarian, I will also be making vegetarian eggplant parmesan. So it's going to be the same as what the chicken parmesan is, but just with eggplant. And yeah, let me get a drink going. This is the rosé. Alrighty. Hey, let's go. We get that smoke. Um, actually, let me use a real wine glass for this. Need a little bit more. That's good. I can either put it on the side, like on the rim, or I was thinking of like cutting slices and put them in, inside. Like a nice bubbly effect when you drop in the strawberry. And then for the margarita. Put it in the cup. And then we have the margarita mix here. Costco brand. Fine. Here. And it actually tastes really good. So with the strawberry. Cool. Put that on there. How much I need. And then we have the hornitos. Just a small bottle, you know? Just for like the five people that are gonna attend. <laughs> Use our finger because alcohol. Mm. Honestly, it wouldn't hurt to add a little bit of salt. Add some salt in here. There we go. So for the pasta, I will need bell pepper, sour cream. Um, I got daisy sour cream because it's supposed to be vegetarian. Just right now, I have the brilliant idea to um, toss in spinach and with the pasta, uh, we need a salt, oh, boiling water. I like adding oil into the boiling water so that the pasta doesn't stick. Um, with parmesan, instead of doing it with chicken, I'm going to be doing it with the eggplant. Uh, and then for the pasta, right now I'll only make one of them, but then on Friday I'll do a mix of all three. I'm gonna bring the water to a boil. In the meantime, uh, we can get started on the eggplant and see how that goes. Uh, I'm not sure if I need to tenderize it somehow. On Friday, I know I'll put it in the oven first and then. Uh, Cover it in whatever I need and, and then fry it. Okay, the water's boiling. Ah. And for the pepper, just to save time right now, I am going to just do one. I'm gonna pop it in the microwave with in a little bit of water, boil it on the stove. Alright, we got the fucking stem. You know how rewarding it feels to like make food for yourself? And like, yeah, 
I mean, hopefully this serves as like a tutorial for people. Throw it in here and then... I filled it like halfway, should be fine. Microwave, let's do two minutes first. Oh yeah, I couldn't find breadcrumbs. So, instead of using breadcrumbs, I'm gonna be crusting the eggplant parmesan with uh, potato chips. So that'll be an interesting twist. So if you take a look at the pepper, um, it didn't really cook much, but I'm gonna, I'm not fully submerged in water, so I'm gonna flip it and put it back in the microwave for five minutes this time. And we wanna crush the chips. And the chips are salty, so I won't be needing to add any other salt to anything with the, the crust. Um, and like I said, for the eggplant parmesan, um, it'll be for someone that is vegetarian. So I got um, parmesan cheese alternative from Trader Joe's. Um, you want to mix in the cheese into the potato chips and garlic powder. And I also grabbed chopped onion. Then we can taste our mix. Our mix. It's actually really good. You can also run the pasta under cold water. So that it doesn't continue cooking. And then we need to see how this parm um high punch parmesan will be. I'll use a little pan because it's a small eggplant. Get some oil going. The pepper. Um it's kinda cooked already. Actually it could be cooked longer. It's like so I'm gonna flip it and then put it back in the microwave. Let's do three minutes this time. You'll be able to notice that it's cooked if it's translucent or like a lighter color than originally. So we have the eggplant. We toss it into the egg. And then we go and crust it with our mixture. I'll do like a double. A double dip. I think uh, the chips and the cheese and stuff might be like too big in size. Okay, I think I have like a nice crust going. So I'm gonna put it into the oil and then like scream a lot. It'll be ready for the ASMR frying. Uh, I'm gonna use the spoon to help me Put it into the oil because the oil is really hot. There we go. And then. Oh, okay. The oil wasn't screaming that loud. Turn back the heat on the, the oil. And the pepper should be done now. Should be good. We can take this out, put it to the side. Ow! It's hot! Check the bottom. Hot, but it actually does feel soft. Pretty crispy. Um, let's do a little taste test. Actually, I might need to add garlic salt onto the the crust mix because it might not be uh, seasoned enough. And then I might need to like cut the cheese into tinier pieces, even though they're just like pretty small already. Yeah, I could definitely use some, some more seasoning, I think. So, let's do some garlic salt. For the pasta, we need the pepper that we cooked in the microwave. Usually I would boil the, I mean I would blend the pepper, 
Um, but it's like 3 a.m. in the morning and my roommates are asleep. I'm just gonna like mash it. And then we have the pepper inside. I'm just gonna mash it. We really just needed the uh, flavors of the pepper. Instead of uh, blending it with fresh garlic, um, I'll be adding the garlic salt in here. Okay. Onion. What a plot twist. <laughs> Quite a bit of sour cream. Habanero here. Mix in the habanero here. the um, mixing butter knife to mix everything up. Okay, so we're putting the pasta, creamy pasta, on the burner to warm it up. And then we just re-seasoned the crust for the eggplant parmesan. So we're gonna try that again. Um, softening the eggplant in the oven first before coating it with the, with the crust and frying it. Okay. Oh, okay, that was perfect actually. 30 seconds. <laughs> and the. Uh, ow. The eggplant's pretty soft now. We have our egg wash here. We have the crust. Breadcrumbs. I have to like force the crust onto there. Crust on the other side. Like almost having to force it on there because it doesn't want to stick. So let me show you what it looks like on the stove. The eggplant parmesan frying. And then the delicious pasta cooking. I don't know if you can see the steam. Let me turn on the surface light. mozzarella cheese because the the eggplant parmesan as I mentioned um, is going to be for my vegetarian well she's pescatarian but she can't eat the chicken parm the vegan part our mozzarella cheese is not melting so I'm just going to take it off the stove I'm going to throw that out let me show you what it looks like there it is oh, the plate's kind of yucky but that's what it looks like. Yeah, time to try this one. Mm -hmm. I'll just use my hands. Okay. Mm hmm. Yeah. Ugh, way better. And then the fact that I put it in the microwave for like 30 seconds, it actually makes the, um, the eggplant melt. So good. And I'm really excited for the pasta. I'm gonna do some oregano. I can actually do the boom and the bang with the oregano. Wait. Bam! And then for the the chicken, since it won't be vegetarian. So I also got regular parmesan for the chicken. We're almost coming to a close here on the <clears throat> um, the practice run for Friday. I just wanted to show everyone like what I was gonna be planning on making and like actually make it, but not the full amount and stuff. Let me show you all what this how this. Uh, delicious ass pasta looks like. So that's, uh, there we go. It's gonna be so yummy. I haven't tried it with everything. Uh, wait, it looks so good. Oh, that's a good one.
so good. I have no idea. Oh my god. Like, I'm not just saying that. It actually came out perfectly seasoned and everything. Everyone, hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching. And I will catch you on the next one. Bye.